Hello, hello, hello. Everything Pisces. Welcome, 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 babies. If you're new here, welcome back. If you are returning, come on in, like, subscribe, comment, share. Thank you guys in advance. You already know what it is, my love. Kick your feet up. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit, and get comfortable, because we about to make it do what it do, love. This is Pisces All Placements, Crosswatchers, Non-Pisces, you're more than welcome. This is general and timeless. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Let's see what's going on for our Pisces today, what are we talking about? Okay, so we got a honeymoon here, babies. Honeymoon phase, attending someone's wedding. So someone may be about to travel. Someone could be traveling to you. Um, someone could be about to go on a honeymoon, going to someone's wedding. You may have recently recently met someone new. And um, you guys could be in the honeymoon phase of a connection. Tell me more. Huh. Somebody going on some type of vacation. Somebody traveling. You will be traveling soon. So somebody could be traveling for a wedding, for their wedding. Someone could be traveling to where you are for a vacation. Somebody's moving. Change your residence, moving in with your partner. So somebody could be leaving somewhere, coming towards you. They're traveling towards you. So if somebody lives in a different city, a different state, they coming your way here, babies. Somebody coming your way. They want to live with you. They coming back doing Mercury retrograde. Um, which I think the next Mercury retrograde, I believe, is in August. So somebody coming back around. Somebody that you have unfinished business with. Um, you all may also may have electronic issues, communicate communication issues, review everything. This is, could be somebody you're not talking to. Somebody finna travel towards you. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. Somebody could be dealing with some type of health issues. Health issues could arise. Somebody could go on vacation and get sick. Somebody could be driving somewhere, flying somewhere. And they have some type of health issue. I am so confused, y'all. Give me one more, Holy Spirit. We're going to talk about it. Could be an air sign. An Aquarius, Libra, or a Gemini. There could be an Aquarius, Libra, or a Gemini that has some type of health issues. That's going to travel towards you. Want to travel with you. Got Earth sign too. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Something about patience, y'all. Just a few more months. Good things come to those who wait. So something's finna happen in the next few months. Give it time. Everything in divine time and let things flow. Okay, so somebody may be coming towards you to ask you to marry them. They may want to have a destination wedding. Maybe they couldn't come to you until um, after whoever this was was having the health issues healed. And they were, they were dealing with somebody with a health issue for some of you guys. For others, there's somebody who got a health issue that may be coming towards you. Wanting to offer you some type of magic. A magic. Mm, magic could be in the middle of this. Um, some type of marriage or connection here. I got a pregnancy. Someone is expecting. Someone may find out they're pregnant. 
There's some kind of cycle here. Fate, karma, something ending, something beginning. So something ended possibly with a baby's mother or a baby's father. Some type of cycle closed. And there's forward movement here. I feel like you're finna travel, they're finna travel. Somebody may have to travel towards someone that's having some type of health issue. Could be an air sign or an earth sign. Okay. 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 <laughs> that's crazy. Caution. Find out more information. Don't overwork yourself. So somebody is trying to get some type of information. Somebody is going to travel somewhere to deal with something about somebody's health. They're going to get some more information. Y'all, this is crazy. Let's, uh, which deck we're going to do? They said the karmic deck. Oh, my Lord, Jesus. Let's see what's going on here. Okay, Pisces. Somebody could have got an abortion. I just seen abortion. Somebody could have traveled, said they were going on vacation so they could uh, get an abortion. Hmm. Clarify honeymoon here, Holy Spirit, for my Pisces. This is some deep shit. Clarify honeymoon. The many faces of fuckery. Somebody tried to get over on somebody. Somebody they were still in the honeymoon phase with in a connection. Clarify vacation. With him, I'm happy with you is drama. So there could be somebody that traveled to go see somebody else. Somebody they were in a connection with. They left. They said they were going on vacation. But they went on vacation with another man or another woman. So if I this Mercury retrograde. Yeah, this is somebody who's always ready for a one night stand. Now, Pisces, this could be your person. This could be someone attached to your person. This could be someone attached to you, a friend or a family member. But somebody was in a connection. They they was in this honeymoon stage. They thought they, you know, they had the right person. This person left and went on vacation without whoever. The, I'm going to say your person, without your person. They person went to somebody else because they said with your person... Um, it's always a bunch of drama, but whoever they went on vacation with makes them happy. And this person always ready for a one night stand. Let's spend the night together. So they went on this vacation so they could spend the night together. Clarify if I help. Now somebody could be drinking alcohol abuse, drowning in their sorrow. Because they didn't found out the truth. So whoever this is, your person that thought they was in this, this great relationship because they were still in the honeymoon phase, has found out that their par person has many faces of fuckery. They said they were going on some type of trip or vacation, and they found out this person went on this trip or vacation with somebody else. This is somebody who's always ready for a one-night stand. Um, they went and spent the night together on this little vacation. Now your person has found out the truth. Clarify this air sign. Uh-oh, hold on, guys. Yeah, this is somebody, the air sign is always, excuse me, never satisfied, always seeking a new supply. Now, if they're not an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini, they can have air in their placements, okay, guys? If they're not a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, they can have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn in their placements. This person is a manipulator. 
And they manipulated your person. And now your person's sitting around drinking. They could have also, look, there you go again. They could have also went and unalived a child that possibly belonged to this third party. That could be why this person is drinking. Clarify Earth sign. Huh, the baby could have belonged to somebody from a one night stand. Yeah, mental health concerns. Now, the Earth sign towards Virgo Capricorn is stressed the hell out. They drinking. They got. They having mental issues here because they were spending their money on this person, and they were spending their money unwisely on this person. They was. They was tricking on this person, and this person was taking their money and out here running around with everybody else and their mama, manipulating them. Always, always ready for the new supply, never satisfied. Yeah. This. This. This person got a bunch of unhealthy habits. Huh. Unfavorable health results. They got some type of unfavorable health results as well. So it's different for everybody with the health thing. Somebody got some type of unfavorable health results. Somebody um unalive the baby. Somebody is sitting around doing this alcohol abuse. Somebody is having mental health concerns here. Yeah, they feel guilty. It says avoid contact with sick people. They may actually have some shit. Now they all up in their head because they know they fucked up. They fucked up. Yeah, and you over here unbothered, Pisces. This is you, the line fem. This is you, Pisces, man or woman. You're in this receiving, fertile, nurturing energy. And you unbothered. There's a third party that feels scorned. That's upset and angry. Yeah. Your person, whoever it is, realizes that they were dealing with a switch up artist. Do the other deck first. Okay, hold on. Let me do this deck first because I just heard him say it. Let me pull it. Pisces. Clarify honeymoon. Yes, yeah, somebody was dealing with some type of illness. While they was on this vacation, they got sick. They caught some type of disease. While they was out dealing with whoever the third party was that they met on this vacation, they caught some type of disease. Clarify vacation. Yeah. Now they stressed. Suffering, darkness, persecution, nightmares. This can be part of their karma. They can have actual demons um, attacking them here. Because I do have fright at the bottom of the deck. I have depression, phobia, paranoid. Terrified Mercury retrograde. Yeah, now this, this person is lonely. Donors, disappointment, isolation with the medical bag. I mean, with the IV. Somebody's sick, sick. Clarify health. Yeah. They should have stopped. Break, pause, stagnation. They should have stopped. And they didn't stop. Now they're dealing with some type of illness and demonic attacks here. Yeah, because this person was stubborn. Clarify air sign. Yeah, they could have made a vow to this person. They could have married this person. Somebody could be wishing and praying and hoping. This air sign could be wishing, praying, and hoping. That they don't have these unfavorable health results. 
Yeah, but justice is being served. Justice is being served. So they're not getting away from this. This person could have, this third party could have been playing around with magic or, um, because these demons are here. Trying to use demonic entities to hold on to somebody and now they're dealing with this sickness, this illness, because they did not stop. So if I earth sign, now they yeah, they had this bright ass idea and it didn't work. So if I illness, yeah, you over here relaxing, peace, tranquility, easiness. And they went towards the person that got them sick. So if I nightmare. Yeah, hesitation, decision, confusion, worry. Now they worry. Now they worry. Can't find loneliness. And angry. So I feel like they both, this is both of their energy. So I feel like um, whoever they were dealing with has this illness. They got, caught this illness while they were sneaking around on this vacation with some third party. Somebody that they were just ready for a one night stand with. They didn't caught this shit with this one night stand and they then brought it back to whoever your person was. They could have also gotten pregnant by whoever this one night stand is. And they they told your person that it was their baby, but they they got rid of it because they weren't so sure if it was your person baby or this third party's baby. Now your person's over here drinking alcohol abuse. Or it could be the third party drinking alcohol abuse. Over here praying that they don't have these unfavorable health results. But your person is angry because they didn't went to the doctor. And now they're sitting here by themselves trying to heal from whatever it is that uh, they caught from this third party, this illness. I do feel like it is curable. We're going to find out. Look Look at the emperor sitting over there. Yeah, this masculine energy. Man or woman. Is this illness curable, Holy Spirit? Is the masculine energy able to get rid of whatever this illness is? One card, please, upright. And y'all gave me 55 cards. Coming out sideways. Is this mask able to thank you? So, yes. It is something that they can get rid of. But they're hurt. They're heartbroken. Um, maybe 50% of them can't, because that one says no at the bottom. But for the majority of them, yes, it's something they, they it was curable. But they're angry that they ever even got it. So if I stop. Yeah. They got good news that it was curable. <laughs> they got good news that it was curable. Yeah. Luck was on their side. They was over here praying. They was praying. Yeah. Now I feel like uh, whoever they were dealing with was only dealing with them for money. It was all about money. Like I said, they were tricking on this person. Can't find idea. Yeah. They thought it was a good idea and they ended up cursed. Hate, catastrophe, misfortune. Yes. They tried to play somebody like a puppet. Dictatorship, domination, reluctance. There could also be, let me read like this, real fast, an earth sign that tried to curse you, Pisces. An earth and an air sign that tried to curse you. Could have been a couple. And now they're both dealing with illnesses and these demonic energies are coming back towards them. You over here relaxed. And now they're angry 
because you're still getting good news and they're dealing with health issues. They could have been trying to block your money, block your connections. Yeah, they tried to play you like a puppet. Dictatorship, domination. Yeah, these people are stubborn. However it go, they were stubborn. <laughs> and you was ready for the bullshit. Prepared. Prompts. Arrangement. You was always on point here, Pisces. That shit crazy here. Yeah, whoever this is, they're dealing with depression, phobia, paranoid. Yeah, somebody was sneaking around. They went on some type of trip or vacation. And what ran, went around came back around with that retrograde right there. And it hit them in their health. Yeah, whoever it is, they're angry that you still got good news. They were not able to stop or block you. Because you're protected. Your money protected. You're protected. If they did send any type of curses or anything towards you, you're protected from that here. That's like honeymoon, Pisces energy. What's going on here? Yeah, so they're watching, stalking Page of Swords. It also talks about, um, Page of Swords talks about, like, delayed news. You may find out about this here. Or your person. It, it took them a while to find out about the third party. Yeah, nine of coins. Now they're single. Or it may take you a minute to find out this person is single. With the delayed news, King of Wands, yeah. But Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius here, or somebody in that energy. Clarify Mercury retrograde. Eight of Wands. Yeah, there's some type of forward movement here. It was delayed, but it's no longer delayed. This person's getting single. They're they're moving forward. They're gathering their strength, so they could be healing, gathering their confidence. But they're leaving this. They're up out of here, yeah. With the fool at the bottom of the deck. They're finna take this leap of faith. Clarify air sign. Yeah, the will of fortune. They're closing out a karma cycle. This air sign could be a karmic. Then we had a king of swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Somebody want to come in and speak their truth. Yeah, four of wands. They want a commitment or a marriage with you here. This is a past person. Yeah, they're in hermit mode right now. They're by themselves. Could be a Virgo. They're in hermit mode right now. Trying to heal from whatever this illness is that they got. They could also have some type of um, spiritual demonic attachments as well. Especially if they were playing around with magic and his curses and shit. And they're angry because nothing is working. They were told. They were told to stop this shit. Or not to play around with this shit. But they hesitated but they didn't stop. Clarify the page of swords. That's a lot. So I have a, a king and queen of cups. And the six of coins here. For the page of swords. So I feel like there was a couple. Could be a, a Aquarius Libra Gemini. A Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Um, There was a couple here. That was paying for this. Or is going to pay for this. Ace of swords at the bottom of the deck. Spirit said that's the truth. Your person could have also seen 
their person, whether it was a king of cups or a queen of cups, given to a third party. It's two men here, two different men, and one woman. This woman looked like she given. This is like the same woman given to this man here, and that's not that man there. And that's the truth. Somebody saw it. They got some type of proof. And now they're seeing a clarify the nine of coins. Yeah, the eight of coins. This person paid for some type of work. Or they did this while they were at work. Now they become a single, the lovers, yeah. So they were at work when they found this out. Somebody was at work when they found out that their partner was given to a third party. The lovers, a choice between lovers. And now they're getting up out of there. Eight of Wands. Can I find the Eight of Wands? Yeah, the fool. Told you, they're getting up out of there. They're running. They're ready for a new beginning. They taking this leap of faith. Yep, Ace of Wands. They want to pass their new beginning. They out of there. Clarify the string. Yeah, and it came out crossing. They're gathering their strength to come back towards you to return towards you here, Pisces. Clarify the wheel of fortune. Which also came out crossing. Yeah, the eight of cups. They're walking away from this karmic ass energy. So they can come back towards you. Gathering their strength to come back towards you. Good news. Yeah, they're dropping a tower moment here. Or they're, they're, there's a tower moment going on in their life right now. Can I find this King of Swords? Yeah, Nine of Cups. They're coming towards you. Came across as well. They see you as wish fulfillment. This could be why um, whoever the third party was was trying to curse his connection. Because they knew that this person... Saw you as wish fulfillment. They knew the truth. Yeah, they see you as a soulmate, a soul connection here, two of cups. And the competition was upset. They wanted this person to continue to join to juggle you and to keep you in third party situations. They wanted this person to continue to betray you. And once this person went into hermit mode, they saw the truth. Yeah. Now they want to come towards you with this Queen of Coins. They see you in this Queen of Coins energy. Queen of Pentacles energy. Wife, husband energy. Yeah, and they want to apologize. Page of Cups. So we got pretty much everybody down here, right? We got the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. With the King and Queen of Cups. We had Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I thought I seen some fire too. One more for Pisces. Who is this Pisces read for or about? Gemini. What is Pisces read for or about? Leo. Cancer. Aquarius. Okay, so if I didn't say it, also, this could be a couple that tried to come up against you as well. Tried to curse you, tried to block you, and angry because um, they couldn't get what you had. And now it's backfiring. They're both sick. Both with some type of illness. Libra. So Aquarius, Libra, Gemini popped out for sure. Aries. And that gave me that fury right there. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. We got Virgo. Fire. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. And Capricorn. Bottom of the deck, we got Taurus. And on the cut, we have Earth. So Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn as well. So once again, it's everybody. We got Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn that popped out. Gemini, Libra, Leo, Aries. Um, we don't have Sagittarius down here. 
Cancer, Virgo, Aquarius, Capricorn, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Oh, we do because we got the fire. Sagittarius is here. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. So everybody is here. Okay, baby. So if it resonates with you guys, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Personals are still marked down, guys, for the next couple of days. Um, if you want to get in before the prices go back up to their regular price. And we'll do some type of giveaway next month for July. And I'm going to promise I'm going to try to be on top of it this month. If not, I'll just keep the prices down low. Um, I think that's all the business, guys. So until next time, I love. Bye, my fishy babies.